We are here. Bring back the love. Bring back the love. Yes, 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 Well done. Uh, we have gotten uh, a very important person as we are all super super important persons. He is going to just take us through why we are here. The the main aim of we being here. Please let's welcome Mr. Eko Samson. Please let's welcome. First and foremost, we want to thank you for the work that you are doing for Ghana. You know, some of you have played for Ghana, and then you brought Ghana's image all, of all over. All of us. You know, so you've already marketed Ghana as a destination. But uh, this uh, particular match is one of our efforts to promote domestic tourism. So we have football or soccer as one of the means by which domestic tourism can be promoted. And we, Ghana Tourism Authority, have seen soccer, identified soccer as one of the means by which we can promote domestic tourism. That's why we are working with you closely to bring the fund back. And with this one of the things that we want to push in, so that as you are crisscrossing, you know, then football, this used to be the case, but unfortunately, it's gone down, but we want to reactivate it. So as part of it, even though we are going to play football, we want you to see one of the iconic sites in the country. And Elmina Castle is one of the iconic sites. Those that read history, this is where Prepper the first was transported. He passed through here to this year. Ghana. There are so many important castles in Ghana. We have three main castles and Elmina Castle is the first built by the Portuguese in the year 1482, followed by Christian Bo Castle. Then Cape Coast Castle is the third and the youngest castle built by the British in the year 1660s. But the Portuguese were the first Europeans to arrive here in the year 1471 to trade and to spread Christianity. And the Portuguese were in charge of this castle for 155 years. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Then in 1596, the Dutch launched their first attack on the Portuguese. They wanted to take over. But this time around, they could not succeed. In 1625, the second attack came in. Still, they could not succeed. Uh, although some of us did history in school. We didn't, didn't go into details like what he has said. I couldn't have said it better. Yes, you know, we did this in school, but we didn't go into this. You know, at this age, I see, I've heard something more. You know. So this, let me explain to you. These are cells. The first one is called the European cell, and the second one is called the African cell. Not a dungeon. Why European cell? Why an African cell? European style in the sense that some of their own soldiers at that time were misbehaving by going out without permission. Some of them went out and got drunk. 
So as punishment from the senior soldiers or as a disciplinary measure being instituted, these stubborn ones were put into this cell and they were locked for a few hours, about two hours or three hours, and they allowed them to come up. Now this African cell, some of the men in the dungeons were not mute, were not cowards. They were still fighting. They were still fighting for their right to be released from the dungeons. And in order to suppress the others in the dungeons, these strong ones were, were picked from the dungeons, brought them here, locked the door, and they were starved to death. No food, no water. So Africa's one was without... No ventilation, window. no window. So those who entered in didn't come out alive. Mean that if someone wants to serve God, the person must come into this room. And beneath is a dungeon where ladies were kept. This is the first time I'm here in Anu. Do we have fancy food from some party? But this is the first time I'm here in Itman. It's been a fun time. It's been a cast. We did in New York share one or two things. It is not easy. Here's your story line up now. I think the 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 name of Fred will find a home of power. So. They are so rest in peace, or they are so rest in peace. I think it is not easy at all. One may you will never be brave. Actually, I feel like a Stephen Bedu, John Pencil, Gordon Abladi, and other people sitting down. I am down. So I think that uh, it is. Yeah, yeah, I worry. You know, so no, oh yeah. So I had in a care tourist center. Be a you know, I don't be fear. Man, I know, but when you go to some other, you go to see a book or some other hardy. After listening to. The history of our ancestors and the rooms that they were kept before sending outside. I'm a bit down, and um, I think uh, I I don't know what to say. I'm sort of worse, and I think uh, they suffered a lot. So it has uh, given me, it has hardened me that uh, I shouldn't give up because what our ancestors went through before. I don't know how to express it, but it was very sad on my side. But I will we'll take this opportunity to educate ourselves and tell our history. One, we also give birth to our children. We'll bring them here so that they also come and see, so that in the future they also learn from all these things. Coming here at Mina Castle, um, the teacher did all the teaching. Um, he explained us how Mina Castle became Elmina Castle and how people were strutted, how people were killing life, how they struggle, how ancestors also sacrificed themselves for us. I would say that 
we 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 this generation this current generation we are lucky and we are blessed to have this kind of life we are because coming here things that i have seen it's my first time visiting here but to be honest with you i'm speechless i even find a place that they call room for no return i've never seen this before i have never never seen this before a room without a window Get the human being for a while. I think we are blessed. Summer inside. Apart from this, myself, uh, 